Well, through the pandemic, we've seen a lot of people giving back, and that's exactly what we're talking about today. We're talking about Woodside Homes partnering up with Homemade Utah. I want to bring in Claire Larson from Woodside Homes, who we've seen on the show before, Don Adamson, who is the executive director of Homemade Utah. And Don, we're going to talk to you in just a second more about how you're trying to end homelessness. But Claire, let's start with you. Just tell us a little bit about uh, Woodside, your beautiful homes that you have. As, as we're, you guys are aware, we're all about giving back to the community. Woodside isn't just about building homes. We want to build communities, and part of building communities is being involved in the community. And Woodside nationally has a member on the board of directors of Homemade, and then locally, our division president is a director on the Homemade um, team and Homemade Utah is fairly new to Utah, but already, I don't know if you guys were involved with the diaper drive last year, but it's already doing amazing things. And we're just really excited to partner up with Don and Homemade Utah and do more. So I'll let Don tell you a little bit more about what we're all doing. Yeah, Don, tell us about Homemade and your company and what we can do to help. Yeah, so uh, Homemade is actually a 30-year-old nonprofit based out of uh, Newport Beach, California. And the Utah chapter is about a year and a half old. Uh, okay. We are the official 501c3 nonprofit of the Salt Lake Home Builders Association. And we leverage the strength and the relationships of that home building industry to provide physical facility improvements for providers of homeless services, construction projects. And this is really, I mean, you're really reaching out into the community and trying to help. We are. Um, housing right now is uh, a major issue, affordable housing especially. Yeah. Um, you know, in Salt Lake County, uh, we brought three new resource centers online this last year. And the concern is that they were uh, maybe not enough beds, especially in the cold weather. <laughs> One of the things okay. we identified in homemade is what's that next step out of the shelter? Um, you know, some transitional or some bridge housing. I, I like it. And it's amazing to see what you guys are doing. And you've got a, a great website where Utahns can go to donate. Tell us how they can do so. Yeah, so if you go to uh, www.homeaid, that's A-I-D, utah.org, there's a donate button in the top right corner. And uh, you can just do that with your credit card. It's, it's very easy and much appreciated. We've got a uh, an initiative going right now where uh, Academy Mortgage has pledged $500,000 in matching funds to Homemade Utah. And so wow. we're trying to raise the other side of that. And Woodside Homes has really taken, uh, taken an initiative to help with that. I love it. And before we wrap up, Claire, tell us you guys are matching donations as well and really stepping it up. Yeah, so up to $10,000 will match a donation. So please get on and put Woodside Home to match. And uh, we are excited about doing that. Well, I love it. And I love seeing companies like this come together. Thank you both for everything you're doing. And uh, we'll be sure to donate. Thank you awesome. for having us on. Thank you.